Good afternoon. Happy Monday. Uh, yeah, sorry I wasn't around on Friday. I got back from the funeral on Friday, on a Thursday night, and I was just like, you know what? I don't really feel up to doing very much on Friday, and uh, so I didn't. But And then I wasn't able to do anything over the weekend, but I'm here now. And uh, we're going to do a little Dishonored, and then I think we're going to do Long Dark, and we're just going to kind of chill, because I really badly need to chill right now. It's actually been kind of a rough couple of days. So, yeah, I, I, I don't remember where the hell we were, but let's get back into it. Oh, that's right, Colvin's Bridge. Okay. Yeah, we were just about to get into Sokolov's house. I like Sokolov's house. It's fun, especially if you're going in to kill everybody, which I am doing. Alright, let me kind of reacquaint myself because I'm more used to Long Dark than I am with this. Alright, how do we want to approach this? So I could just nip up there and get him and never disturb these guys, but where's the fun in that? So really the question is going to be exactly how do we want to kill these guys, not do we? Check the heart real quick. Okay, we got one rune, and that's it, just the one rune. Go ahead. Things are bad. Does the city get any worse? Got civilian, each of those guys. Patrolling over there. Alright. I think. Getting on these lamps is tricky. See if we could just if we could get them all close together. up slightly <laughs> Yeah, so everybody knows I'm here now. <laughs> That's okay. Sokolov may not. He's kind of clueless. Hang on just one quick second here. Alright. So we have stuff to take. And if we walk through that, it will kill us. So we won't be doing that. What else can we grab? Three wire tool over there. Yeah, although I although I think this area is fun when you're just murdering everybody, um, I also 
also think there's a lot to be said for kind of sneaking through it. In some respects, I think it's actually more interesting than do that. Oh yeah, we can come down here and eat sand. I just usually don't do that, so I was confused when I did it. Fairness, you didn't move, and you could have moved, and I blame you for all of this. I need help! And actually, do we go up and over? I think that might be the way to do this. So Look, I'm really sorry that I keep doing that, okay? I don't mean to. I don't entirely know where I am in relation to anything else. I'm just not going to. Alright, yeah, we gotta get up there. That would probably be the best way to do it. I don't have to go all the way around for that, though, I don't think. Help me! Yeah, that'll work. losing track though. So why well, yes, thank you, I will. Did it already read mysteries of Indicia? Uh okay, do we uh, I wanna use the elevator. I think I might go ahead and get it running now before I go up and get so along. Might be easiest in the long run. Pandician Bullrat Study, excerpt from Lab Notes by Anton Sokoloff. The bulk of the rodent is hardly the most interesting detail, though it is the one first remarked upon by visiting colleagues who come to study my prize from Pandicia. Upon further observation, it becomes obvious that the specimen exhibits greater cunning than its cousins native to temperate crystal. Twice in the night I have awoken to find it loose in my apartment, so a new cage had to be devised. An entertaining diversion, but a waste of my precious time. The dietary tests I have conducted have also provided some surprise. The Pandisian bull rat, I can say with confidence, is not a finicky eater. With equal gusto, I have seen my little guests dine upon other smaller rats, living felines, no, and even the corpse flesh of a plague dead woman found in the Renhaven River. Further study is required. This game makes reference to cats. There are cats in this universe, but you never see cats, and I think that is a shame. guy up here, but I don't think we have to worry about him because I don't think he comes over this far. I now turn my hopes and energies to Formula 25. 
which in conjunction with a high heat therapy, which came to me most vividly in a dream last night, has great potential, according to the latest celestial alignment. As for test subject 312, after the characteristic sloughing of the skin, she should be dead by mid-morning tomorrow. Asshole. Much improved, number 312. The formula I administered to you is working exactly as it should. You bad I cannot person. let you go yet, because I have not finished with my study. But tomorrow will make all the difference. Really? You'll release me tomorrow? I'm not gonna die. Yes. Tomorrow I will have the guards remove you from this cell. Late morning, perhaps. But the pain! Can't you give me That's something so for the pain? Cool. I do have many pain That's our things, yes. But alas, I cannot give you any. They could interfere with my research. You should thank me. Soon we will have a cure for this terrible disease. Thanks to all my hard work and dedication. Yes, thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Hey. How did you get past all the guards? Well... Your tattoo is quite unusual. Thank you. It is reminiscent of markings I've studied on cave walls far from the city. Who sent you? Piero? That jealous fool. There's no need to be his lap hound. You and I can come to an agreement. One that I'm sure will please you more than anything Piero treated up. Who are you? What is it you want? Money? Felix, against the plague? I don't know how you got past all the defenses, but I think I can assume if you wanted me dead, well, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Everything within my power to give you is yours. If you'll just let me go. Tempting. I can see you are an intelligent man, so you understand there will be repercussions if you should harm me. I am the royal physician. Head of the Academy of Natural Philosophy, stay back! Thank you, whoever you are. They kept me in a cage, like an animal. Pain is horrible right now. So I'll just hide in a corner and leave when I'm feeling better. Yeah, see, what breaks my heart is that she's not gonna get better. She's just gonna die here, probably. Like. I don't see any way she improves. At least she's not dying in a cage, I guess. Lieutenant Niles' report. As requested, this is a sample of the black market elixir we believe to be coming from one of the abandoned distilleries. No doubt it's inferior to your formula or even to Piero's remedy, but people are desperate. We have not been able to identify the additional ingredients. Perhaps you'll have better luck. One thing of note, some of the men of the watch claim when pressed to have purchased and used this stuff from time to time since it's cheaper than either of the popular brands. None of them report any illness or complications, so while it may not protect from the plague as well, it doesn't seem harmful. Oh, and today's tea is orange. It is very nice. Okay, uh, nine. So we're just for ourselves. Nothing else in here? How many uh, things do we have at this point? Only two. And what... What am I saving up for? I think Second Devouring Swarm. Just I have been using that a good bit, so I think we'll save up for that. Okay, you come with me now. Uh, good luck with everything. Nothing to see here. Just carrying my friend to his bed. Had, had a little too much to drink. He's fine. Everything's fine. It's very normal and legal. Nice. <laughs> I just meant to use the globe. Sorry about that. Come, you're fine. Come back here.
thought maybe I could. I didn't. I'm sorry I keep putting you down, man. I'm just trying to loot people. Doesn't kill him either, I think, personally. I mean, I don't understand how the how the rewire tools let the walls of light know not to hurt you anyway. Doesn't make a lot of sense to me, but Ah, other side. Okay. Why did I put her down here? Did I get over that way? No, it's probably better just to go this way. position himself. He made a neat job of it. Drop him here and we'll be off. Let's go home, Samuel. Good night's work. I will never find all the coins. Never, never. Set up a cell for Sokolov in the old kennel. Shackles and everything. It'll be a shock him waking up in the straw of old dog poop. But from what I hear, he's woken up worse places. Guess we all have at that. I doubt a dozen soldiers could have done it better. Uh, Sokolov's knowledge will enable us to well, strike at the Lord Regent directly, and ultimately help you get your life back. Soon, never get my life we back. won't have to hide in the shadows. The Royal Physician is brilliant, but he was a fool to protect the Lord Regent. Sokolov gave us the elixir, the war machine. He could have made us a great nation. Now he pays the price for siding with a tyrant. You have my thanks, sir. If you wish to get some sleep, now is a good time. Why would we not say good night? Don't worry. We won't start the interrogation without you. Oh, interrogations. I love those. Where do I find a good meal around here? If you think prison food's bad, you should see what the Abbey serves its captives. I think the overseers make it themselves. Good citizen. Excuse me. Yes, Mr. Corvo. I'll oh, make sure your ask for respect it's during this time okay. of mourning. Okay, we can't get it yet then. I don't think we're going to be able to get it until uh, we love him there. Alright, I guess. Hmm, I think P 
here first. I'm working on a new arc pylon. It Are will you? perform hey, absolutely TJ. stunning acts of destruction, I expect. Well, I am all about that. Normally, I'm a natural philosopher, but today, consider me a humble craftsman here to serve. We uh, successfully captured Sokolov. So, that's done. Yay, oh, that's right, I did pick up boot stealth. I did. Oh, I'm so pleased. Okay, uh, yes, we will be buying that. Uh, also that. <laughs> I'm now quiet. I'm sneaky quiet. This was happy make. Uh, do I want anything else? No, I'm gonna get more sleep darts. I never use the pistol. Hope you're doing okay. Uh, I will tell you I did not watch The Walking Dead yet. I'm like two episodes behind now. I didn't see if you said anything about it, but uh, yeah. I assume Henry is still annoying. If he's still alive. Logic is flawed. Anyone can see that. And not an original idea to be heard. His notes are a mess if he even keeps them. Here, How he fish. got this far is anyone's guess. He says what they want to hear. Friend of the rich. That's his method. Sokolov's true genius is pampering the aristocracy. Fools. Look, just admit you have a crush on him. We all know it. Alright, I think... Hmm, probably just go around. We're heading upstairs anyway. Oh, God. I, I think it says something that I've just... Like, again, I'm two episodes behind, and my primary feelings about catching up are just kind of... Uh, uh. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Be aware that looting... Like, I will eventually, but it just don't really having a hard time caring. Hey, I'm gonna listen to your, uh, listen to your guys' diary. Hope that's cool. Lord Pendleton Memoirs, Chapter 41. He seems fine In which it. I bet two of the Boyle women he said I could. only missed the third by virtue of some inclement weather. Two. It was the month of rain. And to counter the gloom, the Boyle ladies hosted three nights of merriment by invitation only. Lydia was most fetching in lavender pants and a tunic of yellow silk. She was pleased lavender with me yellow. from the moment I walked in the door, with my manservant bringing not one, but two cases of effervescent wine from the south. Effervescent wine. In fact, I had come laden with gifts, such that all three Boyle women soon took notice, and they set out to make me more than welcome. We uncorked the wine right away, and as night fell, we... Wallace! Found these interruptions. Yeah, I've been... You might have seen I said on Pillow Fort. Like, I've been... I've been catching up on a lot of TV. And it's all amazing TV. I've been watching, like, stuff that people have said is really good that I just haven't gotten around to watching. And it's been kind of a revelation, because it's been like... Oh, right. Attention, this is Dunwall what good citizens. TV is like. You are required to boil any water from public fountains. So. Yeah, it's kind of hard to go back. Havelock. Bravo, sir. Lord Regent is furious about losing the most recent vote in Parliament. He was counting on the support of Pendleton family and expected limited resistance. Just as you said it would, losing the Pendleton voting bloc has really slowed him down. And since the Lord Regent's defense budget failed as well, he's getting desperate financially. It seems that most of the coin he's using to keep the City Watch going is coming from a close ally. We suspect it's a powerful noblewoman, who is perhaps his mistress. I'll try to dig up more information. As we know, if the Watch doesn't get paid in coin and elixir, their loyalty will start to crumble. Your friend on the inside. Yeah, like I just finished watching The Haunting of Hill House. <laughs> And uh, crying a lot, uh, crying a whole bunch, and it was yeah, it was revelatory. That show's so good, and and hurts a lot too. He is returning now with Anton Sokolov over his shoulder. Simply amazing. Not only can Corvo project lethal force, 
I rather think I can. He can do an extraction that I didn't think possible, and soon the two greatest minds of the Empire will be here, together. If I could get these rivals to cooperate, they could create weapons and tools of unimaginable power. If I could command both of them, well, I'll wait and measure their dispositions toward one another before following that line of thought. It's, um... It's actually a little tough to define it as horror. It, there's a horror element, but more than anything, I think it's a gothic family drama. And it's, it's really about dysfunctional families and how they can hurt each other. That, what I have found most difficult to watch in it was the family dynamic, because it hit really close to home. But it's... it's good. The royal physician is badly shaken up. I'll have the servants see to his new quarters. Take a night's rest, and then you can help interrogate him. I wonder what Piero thinks of our guest. He's a bitch. We're getting closer to reaching our goals. But our position is becoming... <laughs> They're just cool with me listening to this. You don't house and feed a half dozen people without leaving telltale traces. Do not mind. Riverboats pass day and night, and the looters are going to start gathering once they're sure the plague has burned the place out. I conclude, if our enemies are not dead by the month of wind, we will be. There's a sadness in Emily, but she's strong. Weathering the death of her mother just a half a year ago better than most grown men I've known. Once we take Dunwall Tower, I'll see that her life is better. I've always thought that I'd command the Navy in her name, but sometimes I wonder if I shouldn't just take the title Lord Regent and do it properly. And we have our first indication of something brewing that is wrong. Yeah, the, the other things I've been watching that I just am completely wowed by are Homecoming. I binged all of Homecoming. Uh, I watched Mindhunter, which is amazing and soothing in the way that Zodiac is, which isn't surprising given who's involved in it. And uh, all of the uh, current run of The Man in the High Castle, which is also fabulous. Like, all these shows are, are consistently at least good, if not great. And it's like, this can be done, you guys. This really can be done. It's not impossible to do this. Please be as quiet as you can. It took forever for Emily to fall asleep. Poor dear. It's okay, Emily, I'm here. She seems happier when you're here. Though I know you have important things to do. Out there, in the city. Like murder. Lots and lots of murder. Please, please leave a candle for me. I, it gets dark in here and I, I can't see my mother. I just want a candle. Where is Corvo? So sad. No! Mother, run! No! Corvo! It's terribly upsetting. <laughs> yes, she is busy, I suppose. Okay. I'll listen to this. Hope it's fine. There's hardly a need to work on table etiquette. She knows See, it she's all, asleep. even if she chooses not to employ it. She'd rather hold her spoon by the wrong end and pretend it's a sword. Then suddenly she changes and she's all manners, asking for a tea party. I try to oblige her, but I have little to work with. No proper plate instead of a cloth napkin. I've only the bar rack, ale mugs instead of teacups. I've asked for things befitting her, but they have their minds on other things. For now, Emily and I decided to make a pretend dinner using paper and little things she's found here and there. On the floor, I suppose. Not right for a princess, but it'll have to do. Oh, that's right. They did shoot locally in Vancouver. Yeah, because they're, there's a scene where they're running through the forests of New Jersey and there's it's all Douglas firs and giant plants. And it's like, that is not the East Coast. That is not any part of the East Coast. And I know that from the X-Files. Like, they did the same thing. It's hilarious. Yeah, I mean, the, I remember back when they did an ad campaign in New York City where they put up Nazi flags all over, like, the subway. And that, I think, was maybe not the best idea for a number of reasons, and I understand why people were upset. But it's like, they're filming a show, and it is profoundly an anti-fascist show, so how about you chill out? making funny faces while you were sleeping. Hey. 
I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking her bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. Callista will come get me Why when she's done with her bath. Why would I tell her not to hang out with me? Thanks, Corvo. It makes me feel better. Oh yeah, Callista's taking her bath. Okay, we can do some stuff there that um, is not great and kind of problematic, but we'll do it anyway. Yeah, something, something that I really like about Man in the High Castle is that they do a good job of, I think, giving you an idea of how seductive this kind of fascism is. Like, they almost make the rallies seem appealing, if that's the kind of thing you're into. Like, I'm, you know, I'm watching the depictions of Nazi rallies on the show, Martin, and it's like, I see why Let people were break. into this. I really do. I know it looks... I was inventing a new kind of lock. The tumblers shaped like snowflakes. Piero. The truth is, there is no snowflake lock. I was just, you know, looking through the lock. Piero, don't do that. I couldn't bear it if she knew. I know you're a man of honor, and I also know that you can kill me at any time. Uh, and yeah. for both of these reasons, I apologize and beg for your discretion. Honor and murder, that's me. So, what I could do is open the door and go in and bother her, and I could also look through the keyhole. Now, I don't like doing either of those things, but for the sake of being a completionist, I will save and then go bother her. Can't you see? I'm about to bathe. I'm very sorry. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I understand. It was an accident. We have such a hard time maintaining privacy in such it a was crowded an house, accident. don't we? I can't believe this. <laughs> when I took this job, they told me I'd work with good men. Ugh. I feel dirtier than when I started. If you don't mind, Obviously, I'd like to be alone in here. All right, I'm gonna go back. I don't know, it's a role play thing. Okay, I, I don't know, I feel kind of dirty doing that, so I'm not gonna do it, but if you go back and open the door and uh, ask her if she'd like some company, she'll be like, well, normally I would welcome your advances, but this isn't really the time. It's, it's like, no, like, Corvo will never love anybody but Jessamine. That's ridiculous, you would never do that. Anyway. I have not uh, watched or read The Wave, no. I don't know anything about it, actually. Don't... It's ringing a faint bell, but I'm not sure I've ever heard of it, actually. The High Overseer is supposed to be the most pious man in the Empire, living completely in alignment with the Seven Strictures and guiding the people in the religious faction towards spiritual health. Uh -huh. Campbell was a farce. If not for all the blackmail material he accumulated, He'd have never been more than a lower level initiate among overseers. You, on the other hand, are great. Paragon of virtue. All right, let's get to interrogating. I hope Sokolov will cooperate. I'd hope to have him paint my portrait again one day. Just me this time. Well, we will see. It's time to put him to the question. You're part of this rabble, but I know you have your reasons. Yes, he does. All we need is the name of the Lord Regent's mistress. It's very simple. I elect not to tell you. You will have to force the words from me, and I warn you, my willpower is quite legendary. Sorry, so far. No. Not right. Stop! Stop! I will tell you what you need to know. I'm obliged to safeguard Dunwall's greatest intellectual asset. I can only tell you so much. I was not permitted to see her face or hear her full name. She called herself Lady Boyle. You see, I painted her from behind. I assure you, she still makes a striking behind, eh? portrait. But I do not know which Boyle she is. I was to be introduced to her at a masked ball in her honor this very night. But I will miss that party, it seems. 
A masked ball at the Boyle estate. Tonight, I'm going to evolve. the timing is perfect, Corvo. But the Boyles are wealthy and ruthless, so security will be very I'm tight. I'm attending a Of ball. course, you already have a mask, don't you, Corvo? I love balls. Yes, you will be able to mingle with them once you're on the grounds. You'll have to find out which of the Boyle women is connected to the Lord Regent, and take her out whatever way you can devise. We're very close now. Corvo, if you do this tonight, we'll be able to strike at the Lord Regent himself and put Emily on the throne. May the wind favor you. Yeah, I actually remember hearing about that. One of those social experiments, kind of along the line of the uh, Stanford prison experiment. Yeah, I, uh, I do remember the actual thing. Not like the most scientifically rigorous study exactly, but uh, Boy, it sure is indicative. But yeah, Man in the High Castle is great. Hugely recommend. Got anything else to say? I swear I never saw her face. Although I can vouch that her hindquarters are the finest in the city. Perhaps the Empire itself. You're a creep. Mm. I hear you're off to the Boyle's little bash tonight. I have just a tiny favor I'd like to ask you. Could you give this note to Lord Shaw? You'll know him. A rather brusque man wearing a wolf's mask. Uh -huh. In fact, he may be looking for me. Oh yeah, this is great. Thanks in advance. I knew Sokolov would see reason and tell us what we need to know. Thanks in you advance for what's going to happen. Alright, um, let's see if I can get up there. Now that I have the... I'll be sorry to miss the whole thing. Updated. Sorry, were you saying something? Now I have an, uh, a slightly better... Uh... Can, I... can I walk on that? Ah, damn. I should have uh, taken those up here. Alright, now it's... Yes! get up there. There's stuff at the end of it. That worked. Oh, it's just this one thing. That I can't even care anymore of. Boo. Disappoint. I should maybe claim my sword. Maybe. Might be good. Have you ever been in a sea battle? Of course. Oh, this is so cute. Did you ever see pirates? And did you sink me? She's adorable. Of course. Dozens. Oh, yes. But that's not for young girls to hear about. But I will be Empress, won't I? And then I'll have to sink lots of enemy ships myself. And that's what Empresses do mostly, isn't it? Of course. I knew it! I read that some pirate ships have witches aboard that can cause storms and make whales do what they want. Is that true? Yes. Uh, mostly. Maybe we should be quiet now. Very well. Everything was so fancy at the Golden Cat, but in a different way than the palace was fancy. The old Madame Prudence said that all the ladies are princesses and the men come to admire them. Uh-huh. Yeah, that was, uh... Sorry I had to deal with that. A masked ball. You happen to have the most clever mask of them all. Uh, I suppose. The Boyle costume ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. You ready? So, do I want to kill everybody? Do I want to clear out Parliament for her in advance of the purges that we will no doubt have to carry out when we take over? The Lord Regent's pulling out all the stops for the Boyle family. I didn't think there'd be tall boys patrolling here tonight. Watch yourself, Corvo. They don't fool around. The good news is, once you get to the party, that mask of yours lets you blend right in. Enjoy your evening out with the folk of quality. Better you than me. I don't have to 
sure. I'm on the streets. Alright, I need more tea, and uh, I think before we get into this area, this is a good place to stop for now. So I'm going to save, and we're going to jump over to the long dark. I will, I will be back in about five minutes, probably. Yeah, it'll take me about that long.
Okay, back. I switched tea from uh, orange to jasmine silver needle. Lighter and more fragrant. Okay. Make sure this is the right one. Almost, oh my god, we're like almost to 60 days. This is exciting. Alright, what was... Oh yeah, we are Timberwolf Mountain and we're trying to make our way up to the plane. Right, okay. Oh, and, uh, weather well, not great. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I really, I don't think I really want to go anywhere in that. How much more fire do I have? Alright, I, I think I should go get some more wood. The wind does not seem to have shifted. I think I am probably going to be spending the night here. Wait a fucking minute. No, you do not. Alright, well, damn it. Let's just get out of the way. Gotta warm up somehow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I just need wood. Would have been nice to shoot that guy, but we can't have everything. Okay. Well, we've been so lucky with the wind. Let's hope that continues. Uh, oh, good. I have many sticks. You know, I should add wood only bit by bit because. The wind moves, we gotta pick up and leave fast. And I wanna have a uh, surplus wood. Alright, let's go get uh, Let's go ahead and get some more wood. Get very cold again. Ooh, I gotta sharpen this hatchet. Okay. God, God damn, crazy. Uh, is there anything that I can... Uh, I can get a coffee, but I don't do that. Uh, can I make some tea? Yes, I can make tea. Let's do that. I'll warm up and... Uh, oh, a nice little bit of everything. not going to add more fuel. I think I want to save the firewood just in case we need it. Okay. Uh, is there... Can I sharpen? I think I still have a whetstone. Can I sharpen my hatchet? Let's do that. Wind's still steady in one direction. Please let's keep that going. I'm not leaving you behind anymore. Absolutely not. Give me more sharp. I want more sharp. I don't want to jinx it, but I can't help believe how lucky we're getting with this wind. Alright, what's the axe at? Uh, let's do a couple more. I am going to need a new whetstone soon. I'm uneasy about this. Alright, 92 is fine. 92 is good. Let's sleep for an hour and see where we're at. Oh, it doesn't sound like it's improved. Let's go. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Oh wow, the wind like just completely went opposite to what it was. Wow, 
Wow, okay. Uh, not as helpful. Alright, we're gonna have to uh, see if we can get lucky with shelter or someplace else. I'm drinking this fucking coffee. Wow, this is bad. Uh, this is real bad. I swear I thought the other side of the rock would provide us more shelter than it did. Oh my god, oh my god, I need a rock, I need a rock, please. Please, let me make it to 60 days, come on. Come on. Is that a rock? Oh, we're running for it. No, it's a tree. Might be good enough. Oh, I don't know. I don't know, it's a little questionable. Okay, um. You know what? It's good enough for now. die after 60 days. I can die after 60 days. Should not have added that much firework. Damn it, I did it again. Alright, well, uh, yeah. yeah. I guess we're here now. And it's getting dark. That's not amazing. Alright, I think I need to go get more wood. Possibly premature, possibly I shouldn't, but I think I just need, I need some sticks or something. Okay, it seems like it actually got a little better. Uh, I can't take a torch. Okay, but it's actually, it's actually not that bad anymore. I mean, no, wait, it's getting bad again. Uh, I guess let's try here. Please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Please. Come on, little fire. I mean, death is not yet imminent, but... While we're waiting, I will. Oh, actually, um, hmm. let me make some coffee real quick. I just need to close my eyes. No, you don't. Shut up. Okay. Alright, slightly better. My husband is texting me about cranberry sauce. Let me respond to him very quickly. While we hang out by the fire, we wait to not die. Well, pew for now. We're hanging in there. We're still not doing great. Okay, I, uh, this past weekend I, I roasted a turkey. We had like a little Thanksgiving in March. So this means we're eating turkey for like the next two weeks. And uh, I just wanted to pick up some, uh, this might be a mistake. I don't, th oh God, fuck, am I gonna do it? Am I gonna do it? Is this a terrible idea? Yeah, I'm not gonna do it. Um, I wanted him to pick up some, uh, hoagie rolls and cranberry sauce for me. 
Hey! Uh, so that I can make myself a gobbler. Oh, it's better. Which is a sandwich that Wawa makes with gravy and uh, turkey and stuffing and corn uh, cranberry sauce all on the same roll. And it sounds like madness, and it is unbelievably good. Like, it's just crazy good. Sounds like night is coming. Alright, I'm cold, but I'm gonna do it anyway. And we'll just be cold. Fuck, that's a bear. Fuck. Stay away from me. I could go open that container, but I think I want to wait. Alright, so we're just here for now, I guess. Stay. Oh, for fuck's sake, that fucking terrified me. That was as scary as anything that has happened to me in any horror game. Why did you stay away from my fire? Oh my god, this is unfair. Please go away. Please just go away. Le leave me in my wounds and my fire. Son of a bitch. Whatever a female bear is called. Hey, you better run. Oh no, my clothes are ruined. One of my twooks is ruined. All right, what else is ruined? Okay, I still got one, I still got one. Oh no. Oh, this is bad and I have no cloth. Tired. Okay, this could be it. This could be it, this could be it. Uh, what the fuck am I gonna do? All right, well, let's, um, Let's handle what we can handle, I guess. There's only so much we can do right now anyway, it's dark. That didn't work. Oh, I have to use a bandage first. Are you coming back? Yeah, all right, we're dead. This is it. We didn't make it to 60 days. Oh well. Well, it was a good run. Normally I try to be philosophical about this, but uh, I was really hoping to make it to 60 days. Oh my god, am I still alive? Okay, if I'm still alive, we gotta go. But I think I'm probably not gonna survive this. God. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna die. There's nothing I can do about this. My pants are ruined. I don't think I even have time to heal my wounds. I'm just gonna die. Actually, I mean, let's let's try for it. We're gonna have to run though, because it's the guy's probably coming back. And I can't even see anything or walk straight. I'm just like lunging around and staggering and Whoa, whoa. What's happening? Okay. What the hell happened there? Was he dragging me away? I think he was just dragging me away. That was very weird.
Well, as I thought, Timberwolf Mountain was the end of us. Like I said, I try to be philosophical about this, but I actually am fairly annoyed. I really, really wanted to make it to 60 days. I was doing so well. The bear should not attack you when there's a fire. I think that's unfair. Well, okay. Uh, now I get to do something that I had promised to do, which is to try for interloper mode. Which I, I, okay, I promise you, if I do interloper, I'm not going to survive the first uh, day. I promise. Hey, you know what? Again, it happens. Okay, so this is going to be... Wait, you have to craft everything? I don't know if I'm good enough at crafting to do that yet. Okay, I think we're going we're gonna to try Stalker. We're going to try Stalker. We're going to see how Stalker goes. Um, and I, I, I don't expect to do well here either. But, uh, okay, we'll start random. We'll do female. And I do think I'm going to go ahead and give myself a couple of buffs here. Uh, okay, I like having stamina. Uh, do like that. Cold fusion... It would be nice to not need more food. All right, so we'll do that. We'll do sprinting. And I think we'll get a cold bonus. And let's see how this goes. I appreciate you being mad on my behalf. <laughs> I really do. Thank you. It is what it is. That's the, that's the game. You know, that's the game. You'll die eventually. The only question is when. Hey, it's one of my qu uh, favorite quotes from uh, Fight Club. I love the... Oh, fuck. Are we in Forlorn Muskeg? Or are we in Desolation Point? I'm not sure. Well, oh no, we're in Costa Highway. Okay, that's actually not so bad. Uh, yeah, let's... Uh, I think the house is up here, so let's head up to that. Uh, I really love Fight Club, and I hate its fans. It's like Christianity. Fight Club and Christianity. Like that, uh, that movie and that book were kind of formative for me in high school. And, uh, because I think I understood them. I was like, this is explaining a lot of what is wrong with a lot of the guys I know. In a really efficient way. Alright, what does it feel like? Uh, okay, well, cold. So, let's get indoors and uh, reconnoiter. I, you know, I'm, I'm disappointed we didn't make it to the full 60 days, but I'm actually kind of excited to start a new game. Kind of excited to start fresh and see how things go. It's, it's very good if you like that kind of movie, and I do. David Fincher is one of my favorite directors. He's done some of my, he's done some of my favorite movies, including my comfort movie, which I mentioned before, which is Zodiac. That's one of my big comfort movies, anyway. And, uh... Yeah, he's just a really great visual storyteller. Yeah, like, I mean, I'm, 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 uh, my OCD does express itself sometimes in uh, obsessions with numbers, so I wanted a nice round number like that. Hey, Flossie. I am doing fine. I hope you are well. All right, actually, before I do any more... I'll pick that up. Before I do any more searching, let's see uh, see where we're at. I got killed by a bear. Just to catch you up, I got killed by a bear, and I started a new game in stalker mode. I was going to do interloper, but I actually got slightly intimidated at the last minute, so we're doing stalker instead. Okay, clothes. Not amazing. What is the condition of the clothes? 
okay. Boots could be better. Boots could be better. We have a can. We have some accelerant. We have no food. All right, let's get going. Also, I kind of like, it's, I kind of enjoy how early in the game you're just picking up everything and you're not being picky. You just pick up everything. Bear death at Timberwolf. Yep. I, I thought the, mistakenly that the fire would protect me, but um, I was trying to shelter in a blizzard. Excuse me, behind a rock. Oh, and ooh, a And uh, out of the darkness and the snow came a bear. And then as I was trying to heal, desperately to heal myself and get away, it came again. And then it dragged me away and it ate me. That's how it goes. That's the game. I'm, you know what? I'm sad that I never did get to the point. I think we're gonna try again. Yeah, it was like a genuine for real jump scare. Like I was frightened. It was effective as hell in terms of fear. Hmm. Okay. Like, you know, I'm annoyed that I didn't make it to 60 days, but good on you game. That was extremely well done. So yeah, we're doing Stalker now, and uh, like I said, I do think I'm gonna go ahead and try and get to um, try and get to Timberwolf Mountain again because I really want to get to the plane. It's neat, and I like Timberwolf. I, I did, even though it killed me. It was a cool map. I'll take it. Hey, all right. Uh, break down a curtain. It was. It was a bit like Annihilation. Yeah, bare face not quite as freaky. Otherwise, annihilation. God, I love that. This stuff will come in handy. Okay. Uh, let's take all the water. So it spit me out in Coastal Highway, which I'm pretty happy with. Uh, you know, this is a decent map with a lot of stuff on it. Uh, oh, it is a bit wolf-heavy, though. I just remembered. Hey, a took. Nobody needs this anymore. All right. Is this everything? All right, that's the back of the half. I think, I think that's everything. Yeah, I think that's everything. Unless there's uh, something under the bed that I missed. Why do I crouch so slow? Oh, that movie... That movie freaked me out, and it was like existential terror. Hey, lantern. The that is that is one of the movies where the uh, actual soundtrack is terrifying. Like the music that plays at the very end when uh, she finds the orb is just genius and and so scary. That movie's so great. That movie did not get enough attention when it came out. For obvious reasons. All right, let's make one more quick pass with the lantern, just because this is how I miss things. There's, there really isn't anything usually in the tub, is there? I don't think there is. Nothing in the corner. Nothing in this corner. Did get all the shelves. Nothing on the counter. What about in here? Everything. Oh, I almost didn't get the matches. All right. Uh, before I move on to the next house, let's uh, let's check all our clothes situation again. All right. Well, right now we just layer everything. And. Uh, can't repair anything yet because <laughs> I look very silly. I can't repair anything yet because you know, I don't have a sewing kit. I don't think. Do I have a sewing kit? I don't have a sewing kit. Alright, so that's got to be one of the things we find. But in the meantime, let's go to the other house. I miss my warmth bonus. Like, I'm excited for a new game, but I miss my warmth bonus. It's nice to have that. I'm not crazy about that sound. I 
I mean, the, the Veradeth really just is a perfect example of how you can do everything right in this game and be doing quite well, and then a couple of uh, unfortunate incidents in quick succession can just completely end you. In fact, even if I hadn't been dealing with the Blizzard, I don't think I could have survived that bear. I was in decent condition when it attacked me, and it didn't make any difference. And again, you know, respect, because that's kind of how this game works, and it's how it's supposed to work, but it's still irritated. Ooh, fishing hunts. Fishing on height. I will, I refuse to play this game without a Kanatuk. Gotta have one. At least one, preferably two. Hey! do any fishing just yet. I do have some food. Hey, they're not very good, but I will take them anyway. I'm very fashion forward. Okay, let's move on. I do have a bedroll, okay. Yeah, you don't have a bedroll when you start an interloper. You have to make shelters or craft one. Or find- actually, you know what? I don't even know if there is one on the map in interloper. There may not even be a bedroll. Yeah, I'm not ready for interloper. <laughs> I'm not remotely ready for interloper. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait on that. Someday. Someday, not just yet. Mr. Misanthrope, what you got for me? Okay. I wonder, uh, wonder what the TV does in, uh, in Aurora. I don't know that I've actually ever seen a TV during an Aurora. Uh, oh, let's uh, whip out the lantern. As far as I know, there's no weed in this game, but you know what? With the cabin fever being a problem after a certain amount of time, there should be some weed. Also, like, these are, these are, uh... This will come in handy. These are people who live in the middle of nowhere. Gotta do some with their son. Alright, we're doing alright so far. Main concern at this point, I think, is clothes. No, but I definitely need some. Ew. Oh, of course. But uh, I mean, I think you can make all kinds of medicinal cases for uh, for weed in this game. Well, I can break those down for the leather anyway. You should be able to go into that door. I want to go in that door. It's not fair. All right. I think we cleaned out the downstairs. Two-story house. Fancy. Oh, hatchet. I also want a hatchet. Very I much. Use this. And the knife. be streaming again. I, uh, I'm glad I took a day uh, not to. Uh, I think that was mentally good for me, but uh, glad I'm doing this again. I'll take it. Nice. Although something I've noticed is that when I uh, do a lot of streaming, I don't really play games for myself as much. Like, I have not uh, finished Death of the Outsider, and I want to, but I just have to make time for it. 
and I'm using my game time on this, which is fine, but kind of got to plan a bit. I don't stream on weekends. Maybe I can do it on the weekend. I also try not to work very much on weekends just because I do do a fair amount of work during the week. All right. Uh, what time is it again? Uh, I think we'll. I think we'll stay here overnight. Um, hmm. Let me go back upstairs. Yeah. Um, let me go back upstairs. And or do I want to actually? Huh. I think I might actually try and get back to the mainland. Let's let's take a look at clothes again. Uh, no, these are still the best ones we got, I think. Um, or they will be once we break these down and fix them. Okay, I'm not gonna do this now. I do think we're gonna head back to the mainland. And, uh, yeah, I found crappy mittens. It's better than nothing. Let's, um, hmm, which way do we come from? Came from back there. Okay. Uh, um, um, let's, yeah, let's get to the fishing huts and kind of leapfrog back to the mainland. That's what we're going to do. And I think we'll, uh, stay overnight at one of the houses there. Which, is I back in that direction? Yeah, I think this is actually closer. To, oh no, there's some houses. Okay, first that fishing hut, and then that house over there. It's a nice day. Cold, but I'm not uh, not losing heat too much, too fast, just yet. Huh, should I go see what that body is too? I think I might. Stuff will come in handy. Oh, does it does that happen to you? I have so far not I have so far not noticed that happening on my phone, but I need to get a new phone, so uh, once I do. Oh I have no fuck. This is a great start. Alright, well. I've ruined my mittens. Bullshit. Ah, <sighs> fine. <sighs> nope, 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 not that. Not that. This. <sighs> Alright, let's go. Oh my god, look at all those wolves. Oh my god, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh, this is bad. <laughs> I didn't know- I didn't know there were gonna be this many. I don't like it. I don't like it. I hate it. I hate it very much. I guess let's go see what this body is, and then let's go to those houses and pray. I mean, I am gonna work my- have to work my way back in that direction, so, uh... This is going to be interesting. This is going to be very fun and cool. I mean, I can... I think if I stay this far out, I'll be okay. Hey, dude. Oh my god. I need rifle ammunition, though. This stuff will come in handy.
All right, let's get out of here. I don't see any wolves close to me here. I guess we'll probably be okay. Okay, another body. Hopefully it's a person. Because I think I'm actually okay for food. So something I am going to try to do more of in this run is uh, crafting. I really did not get very much into crafting, and if I ever want to have a chance of making it through Interloper, it's going to have to be something I learned to do. All right, let's check out this guy. Nobody hey. needs this anymore. I lost my mittens, but I got a jacket. Oh, I see those those things keep those things keep fucking fooling me. I keep seeing them and reflexively thinking I can pick them up because they're brightly colored. Unfair. Okay. Nothing. Probably useful. Yes, food's probably useful. Hey, tea. Definitely not as much stuff. I mean, when you play as interloper, like, every cabinet's empty. It's actually a little frustrating. If it's not, uh, again, something that you're willing to be philosophical about. It drives Rob crazy. He hates it. I can at least uh, repair the clothes I've got. I can at least break down and repair the clothes I've got. I'm happy about the pry bar. This pack is getting kind of heavy. I think it took me longer than that before to to find it to find one. No, I don't want to sleep just yet. Go away. Absolutely sure that I'm not missing anything. Ah, nothing up there. Oh yeah, we do wanna go through the bathroom. I think I can use this. Oh yes, I think I can. Hey socks again. Okay, uh how much water do we have? Oh, plenty. Okay. Hey. No, don't extinguish it yet, but there's fuel. Hooray. Okay. Now you can extinguish it. And now we'll go. Fuck. Bear. I think, I think that was a bear. I can mean, no more bears. No bears. No. No more. No, thank you. Hey, there's a fireplace in here. We can actually cook some of the stuff we play. Yay! I'll take it. Excellent. 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 All very good. Yeah, so far this is going pretty good. So far I'm uh, pretty happy about this. I think uh, the big challenge for me in this is going to be the wildlife. I think I'm, I'm good at dealing with everything else right now for the most part. I mean, obviously blizzards can still really get you, but uh, 
Yeah, I'm not very good at handling the wildlife. And again, I don't know how you get good at that besides really getting good with the gun. Slash uh, bow, slash other weapons that are available. But if a bear is coming at you, I just don't know how much there really is that you can do about it. The flare gun's nice to have. The flare gun is nice to have for that. That will chase a bear away. But I don't think I ever did find one. I found a flare. This stuff will come in handy. All right, we're gonna stay here tonight and we're gonna fix up clothes and getting everything in as good condition as we can. And then uh, go on our way tomorrow. No. No uh, first aid kit? Okay, fine. Let's go start a fire. Just to have the light, mostly. <clears throat> oh man. <coughs> I failed at swallowing that tea. That was a complete failure of a very basic thing that human beings do constantly. Go me. Okay, and uh, where was the firewood? Was it over here? I thought it was over here. Yeah, it's by the door, isn't it? Oh, or is it... Where the hell is the wood? Oh, there. Okay. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. You gotta get used to being weighed down because it is gonna get so much worse than this. All right, excellent. Uh, let's drink some water. Uh, ooh, let's cook this rabbit. Uh, if we're going to be running around with wolves around this much, I think I want to actually try and minimize the amount of meat that I ever have to carry. All right, let's deal with the clothes. Which mostly means for the moment breaking things down. God, those are useless. I mean, they're better than no shoes, I suppose. But oh, crap, fire's going out. Fires don't speak English. Well, that didn't work. I'm bored with this. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. Uh, let's just throw a bunch of sticks on it. I can always get more sticks. Okay. Back to the clothes. How does it take 20 minutes to break down a pair of socks? I think that's questionable, personally. Okay. Yes. Yes. All right, things are going much better now. Things are going much better now. So, let's see what we can fix. Getting shoes in order would uh, probably be best at present. All right, how much more time do I have on the fire? Skip 
us one more round of repair. Excellent. most desperately needs repair. Come on, fire. Hang in there. Just let me finish. Damn it. Alright. Let me drink some more water. Do I want to do more fire? I just would I would rather do it now and uh, I'd rather do it now and have all of tomorrow to run around rather than have to spend time on repairing. Come on, little fire. Oh, back to our starting fire ability. Isn't this nice? That's right, I'm, because I started fresh, I don't know how to do fucking anything. Okay, yeah, once you get most of the way through starting, you are by definition required to finish cannot go out on me at that point. It's not allowed. It's a crime. It's a long, dark crime. I need to find a place to rest. Let's just the fire. Another hour. Okay. Uh, might be it for the pants. Let's see how else we're doing. Oh my god, it's 100%. Love it. Oh no, my toque. No, no, Took. I'll save you. I'll get you to 100%. Oh, come on. I'm gonna run out of light. Alright. Alright, let's, uh, let's fuel up the lantern and stagger to bed. I think it's good enough for now. I'm sure it won't let me harvest in the dark, even though all I'm doing is ripping stuff up. It really should. Okay, well, that's, uh, that's good enough for now. I do think we get... Do we get all this map through mine? I can't remember. We'll figure it out. Let's go to bed. Actually, first, let's eat some food. Oh, do I have a can opener? Don't think I actually do. Okay, so that's something else we gotta get. Because opening cans is gonna be an absolute pain in the ass until we do. Or at least we're gonna lose uh, calories. second, I gotta add something to this list here. Let me into my phone. Man, I could use a drink. Uh, okay. Ooh, it doesn't sound like we're going anywhere. Just yet. Because no matter how good my clothes are, I'm sure I'm not equipped to find a place. Alright, I guess let's go back to clothes. This we are breaking down. Well, I'm glad I at least have a surplus of cloth. That's nice. See, but we're gonna fix when we fix those we 
Yeah, see, when we fix those, those will be in better shape, so. Harvest those. I'm gonna need to have a nap. Oh, it sounds better. Oh, wait, if I, f if I fix that up, that probably will be warmer than the scarf, actually. I break them down. All right. Let's do a little bit more repair. And I'm going to go sleep for a bit. But I do think we'll get going today. Yeah, okay, that's better. That is better than the scarf. Oh, I'm so fun. glad we found a sweater like that. That's really good. Set. Okay. Oh yeah, you need fixing real bad. You know what, we actually might stay here the night, I don't know. I'd rather get clothes all in order before we do anything else, but we are now actually out of uh, now out of cloth. Although, wait, there's stuff to break down here. Isn't there? There's like curtains and shit, I think. Yeah. Yes. I will uh, die on a wolf infested battlefield for Gantuk. Which I realize is a uh, kind of defeats the purpose of having it somewhat, but I still would. <sighs> yeah, we're definitely staying over, but if we're gonna do all the repair that we need to do and uh, set out with everything in top condition, assuming well. This sewing kit's probably not going to last me through everything. Yep. Well, we did repair most of everything. Oh man, I let that uh, let that fish get ruined. Well, it probably wasn't very good condition anyway. But oh yeah, I've got these things to harvest too. That we definitely want to do. I'm glad when the clothes get ruined, you can still harvest them. It would be really unfair if you couldn't. Okay. Um, da -da 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 -da. Let's, let's drink and eat and go back to sleep. Let's see, is there anything I can eat that's not in a can? Not really. Yeah, see, we, we lose a good bit of calories when we, uh, we lose a good bit of calories when we don't have the can opener. Oh well, at least we have food. Take the rest of the water. Back to sleep, I guess. Let's just do a full seven hours. A 
day. A whole day. How exciting. Back to sleep. Time, not yet done. That's one more hour. And then I think we'll just have to pass time. Fully rested. Sun's coming up. Well, let's smash open a can of dog food, I guess. This is life. Yeah, I guess let's get out of here. I don't really think there's uh, much left to do. We'll see what the weather's like. Oh man, it's still pretty dark. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna pass time for an hour. Surely there must be some light now. Good enough. Adequate. Wait, let's make sure there's nothing over this way before we... Oh, that's right. Fuck, I thought I saw a bear before. Alright, I don't know if I want to stay here too long. We'll pick up some sticks, though. Just here, bear. God, I'm so scared of bears now. All right, let's go. Oh, um, uh, maybe I should load a rifle with my <laughs> with my one bullet. <laughs> Make them count. Real cold. Well, it'll warm up as the sun comes up. Yeah. Hopefully, I'll find some more. But it's gonna be a wolf gauntlet from here on. So that will be fun. So if all of the wolves out on the ice could stay on the ice, that would be absolutely fantastic. Again, I love the sound design in this game. I love that like when you're not really, really weighted down with stuff, you're not carrying a ton of things, your movement is quieter, you don't like hear your pack kind of clunking and jingling around. You can hear a bit, but it's just it's just great. It's just great design. It's a subtle thing, but I really think that it matters. Could all be asleep. Nope. 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 Okay. Uh, okay. Well, we're just gonna. We're kinda gonna go up here a bit. Uh, yeah. And we're gonna see stuff coming at us. to be careful, I guess. All I need to do is just randomly sprain something. Not be able to hold the rifle. That's the bear. 
Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah. Fuck you. Well. Better than nothing, I guess. <laughs> I should be able to, like, bash the wolf over the head with the stock of the gun. I should be able to do that. Cold. Oh my god, fuck you all. At least I can move pretty quick. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to move pretty quick through the whole map. Or at least until I get off the road section of the map, which I think is where the majority of the wolves are. Well, we're coming up on some stuff anyway. Hey, is there like... Are there houses over here? I thought I saw... No, it was, it was further up. Okay, yeah, there's some stuff here. Good. And I don't have anything to fight them with except for a crowbar at this point. I mean, again, better than nothing, but... Oh my god. Oh my god. All of you just fuck off. Just... Fuck off. Every single last one of you. Fuck wolves. Huh. Pretty good. What kind of shape is it in? Ooh, that's right, I have this, I have this, I forgot. Oh, okay, uh, as soon as we get a sewing kit, we'll fix it. that was something. And that as well. And that. You really should look at the shelves carefully because it's easy for stuff to just kind of blend into the background. Upstairs. If anybody has any rifle ammunition, like you, for example, do you have any? No? Ugh, loser. That's probably why you died. Serves you right. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Alright, well now I'm doing good with clothes, but it would be nice if I could fix some of them. Is that vest better than what we got? Yes, by a significant amount. Although maybe that one would be better if we fixed it. We'll have to hang on to it until we get a chance. All right, looking carefully. No sewing kit, don't think. Don't see one. Okay, moving on. I don't even know why I've still got this gun. It's useless right now. Hoping we'll get lucky with ammunition at the Quonset hut. But we'll have to see. I 
I suppose ammunition could kind of show up in any place, but... See, I'd love to go down and check those huts, the fishing huts, but... Uh, I don't know, it's Wolf Central out there. I kind of feel like not... I'm not sure I can carry much more. Uh, but what if there's more stuff out there? There probably is. What if the stuff is great? On the other hand, wolves. I don't know what to do. Okay, I have way too much antiseptic. Although, I don't know. The wolves may make me glad of it. Hmm. This will come in handy. Nothing in any other microwaves. Anything on the shelf? Doesn't look like it. I'm definitely buying over-the-ear headphones soon. Just do not like what I've got. Uh, I think the trail boots are what we already have, so we'll probably break that down for leather. Anyone got a sign kit? No, but we have water. I can use this. Oh, those might be better than what I got. Let's check real fast. Or no, I can just wear them. Okay, uh, slowly, slowly the clothing situation is improving. It will improve even more once we can actually fix more of the stuff it. we got. First aid? Okay. Boy, I'm uh, full up on socks currently, aren't I? Oh, it's getting cold outside. I should maybe close the window soon. It was actually in the 60s. This space, stuff will come so in handy. It up for a while, but. Uh, I can't believe the 60s is warm for me right now. It's so pathetic. Do I hear a bear? Do I hear a bear? Was it just really creepy? Hey, well, there's the garage, so, uh... Oh my god, I keep thinking I can jump, damn it. I can't. I can't jump. This game's bullshit. for anything. I suppose food counts as being prepared for everything, yes. Wouldn't be... I, yeah, scavenging the bedding would be... Uh, that would be really great. And I mean, again, I understand that they kind of have to um, include a bit of artificial scarcity sometimes, but uh, I really think you should be able to wrap yourself up in a blanket if there's nothing better okay let's see what we got and we're definitely pulling out the lantern for this there's just too much stuff here and I don't want to risk missing any of it and there's some lantern fuel anyway no don't extinguish Excellent, I love soda. I love it because it addresses two problems at once. this anymore. Hey, Walt, you're wrapped. Yeah, I'll take that. I never did end up... Hey, yes! Yes, yes. I never did end up using any of the uh, water purification tablets I had. The 
best to be prepared for anything. See you later. I should be here tomorrow as usual. Hey, and I, yay. Okay, all I need is a hatchet now. Oh, walking a bit slow. This pack is getting too heavy to well, carry. Well, the running was nice while it lasted. Bedroll? Hmm. Oh, I think I can start leaving newsprint behind. Okay. Hey, what's that over there? Oh, also, we didn't look at these yet. to lots of mittens and gloves and such. Aha! Okay, um... Oh, it's not. It's, it's for you. Wait, let me make sure there's nothing else in any of the racks. Don't think so. Hey, there's a map of Coastal Highway. I have really noticed that. Don't think you can use it though. It doesn't really show you very much. Okay, let's put this away. Let's refuel it too, since we can. Oh yeah. Yeah, we are not hurting, hurting for lantern fuel. That's in good enough shape though. I'm not gonna worry about that. Okay. So, close. I wish this would tell you how good it would be if you completely fixed it. It says only a tiny bit of warmth though, so it's probably not gonna be super much of a good bet, so I'm not gonna worry about it. Just gonna harvest it. Hospitable outside. May not go outside just yet. And break this down also. are better than what I've got. Alright, we'll uh, wear those instead. Mm, they provide very little moisture protection, but they also give you a little bit more, uh, they give you a little bit more protection. Okay. Uh, actually, I'll keep At least one pair of mittens. Just because at this point we can spare the weight. But the 
press for the correct term. Man, I don't actually know if I need all this cloth right now. But I guess having a lot of it is a good problem to have. Until the wind gets better, we're not going anywhere. Is Hoodie better? No, not really. Oh, okay. Sounds better now. That's good. Let's fix up these socks just a bit. I don't think we're going to overnight here. I do think we'll try and get to another house. Shoes are good enough. I'm satisfied with the shoes. This I will fix. That's good enough. All right, I'm, I'm reasonably happy with everything, so we can go. And... All right, our clothes hitch is good. We are not in imminent danger of freezing. moving pretty slow, but that's okay. I'll take it. Nah, I probably should drop the flares. I just never use them. We here. Got a lot of soda right now. That's a good thing. I'll eat that. Absolutely. A lot of peaches. Actually, hey, do I? No, I'm absolutely fine with water. Do not currently need more. Yes, I'll take a cup of coffee. I think I'm actually going to leave the trail boots. I think I actually can, uh, I'm at a point where I can do that. In fact, save a pound. Take a newsprint roll. Oh well. This stuff will come in handy. Uh. Yeah, I think I'll take those and fix them up. I think they'll probably be good to have uh, once repaired. Oh, 
God, I hate that it's situated like that. It's impossible to see anything. I mean, I guess, I guess if I, if there was anything to pick up, I'd see it. Hey, another sound kit. Nobody needs this anymore. Okay, pretty good. Next one. Sprinting was nice while it lasted, but now those days are over. <sighs> oh, actually, uh... Before anything else happens to me, that rabbit. Let me not be carrying that around. Hmm. Okay. Why do you sound bemused by crackers, Astrid? Why are you bemused by crackers? Let's take a look at those sardines and see if those are too much of a risk. I may not keep them. Can't remember if I have antibiotics or not. I'll have to check. I don't know. Could end up being useful. All right. What's the state of these sardines? Um. I'll give it a shot. Okay. We're all right. Those are the only two sardines? Okay. Hmm. This will come in handy. I'm actually gonna leave that. We uh we are now flush with cloth. And most of the stuff that I have is repaired as much as I want it to be. So, so far, in terms of the amount of gear that we're finding, this isn't... Things don't seem to be significantly more sparse than uh, they were in Voyager. So, I'm guessing, once again, that the big problem for me is going to be wildlife. The big problem is just going to be more of them and more aggressive. So, we got that to look forward to. Gonna get to this house and uh, repair the last bit of the clothes I want to repair. And uh, I think I might stay here for the night. This also appears to be the last house in this little cluster, so that works out fine. Don't feel like we're wasting daylight just sticking around. past that giant clot of them. Hey, sewing. I don't know if I've ever found a sewing primer before. Well, that's nice. Okay, so the last thing I really want to find is a hatchet. Alright, out comes the lantern. Take it. Yes, I will. Nope. I'm 
satisfied in my took life. My weekend was okay. Uh, had, a, had a rough couple days. Um, just, I don't know, a lot of stuff kind of seemed to happen all at once, and I got a bit really frustrated with my writing. Oh, I got a, I got a rejection on a story that I was optimistic about, and it was kind of crushing. Put me in a funk all afternoon. But... It was okay. It was a weekend. I feel uh, better today. Oh, yours was okay. Oh, we already looked at that. Why does it always happen when I've already searched something? This weird little freezing thing. Hey, rejections happen. Like, that's the game. It sucks, and uh, I kind of went through this period of like, you know, people who write professionally are, um, it's an incredibly irrational thing to do because you're just setting yourself up to get pummeled in the chest a lot <sighs> and to be frustrated and lonely constantly. <laughs> so it's kind of like, why would anybody fucking do this? But how I made myself feel better was apparently to write a new short story. So whatever, I'm stuck. I'm never getting out of this game. Apparently I'm never going to be able to stop. It's a compulsion. Really? That's- I guess that's- that's a- I like that. That's- that's um- that's a very nicely philosophical way of thinking about it. This stuff will come in handy. I'll tell you though, it- it- I think I've said this before, it makes it even more awkward when the people who rejecting- who are rejecting you are your friends. It's like, uh, boy, I'm really sorry I let you down. <laughs> uh, didn't want to do that. I apologize. Okay, uh, do I have enough light to fix anything? Probably not. No, I certainly won't have enough light to finish fixing anything, even if I have enough to start. So, um, hmm. Time is it in real life? Okay, I think what I actually may do is go downstairs and break up, go outside and see if I can get some firewood. Although, I didn't look by the fireplace for firewood. Probably ought to do that. Oh, wait, is there no fireplace in this? I don't think there's a fireplace in this house. Oh, yeah. That was the other one. And I don't really want to go back and get to it. So, we're just gonna. Yeah, thanks. I don't know if it's keeping my chin up so much as it is. I guess this might as well happen. But. Oh god, I can. I mean, I can't. I can't really imagine in the sense that I've never experienced it. But uh, anything. I mean, anything where you're doing something creative that gets judged by somebody is just. I mean, it's it's awful. It's, I don't know why anybody does it, except that they have severe problems, which I do have, so. But, it's, you know what, you just, you get to work on a new thing. You just get back to work on a new thing. And you trust that in the end it's going to be worth it. Somehow. Alright, where are all these cans that I don't need? Well, with my record of losing my pot, I should probably keep one. Alright. Well, I can't repair anything, so I think I'm going to sleep, and I think we might call it there for now and pick back up tomorrow and uh, repair all the rest of the clothes that I want to repair. Since uh, there's no way I'm doing it now. All right, yeah. All right, this is, uh, this is going to be it. Um, yeah, we'll pick up again tomorrow. Uh, I'll try and start streaming a little earlier. Um, if I can get my ass in gear and actually get some more work done early in the day, but yeah. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me, guys. Always great. Great to see you. Uh, and yeah, uh, we'll, we'll get this going again tomorrow. Hope you're having a good afternoon, morning, afternoon, evening, night, whatever time it is where you are, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.